Today, I'm kicking off a Show It SEO series where I'm diving into website SEO tips for beginners. And today's video is all about page titles and meta descriptions. Now, if you're a website owner, you've probably heard these terms before, but you might not be entirely sure about what they really are and why they're important. So in this video, I'm explaining what page titles and meta descriptions are, why they're crucial for your website's SEO, and how to write effective ones. So let's get started. Hello and welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Maureen from thecreativeimpact.com where I help creative small business owners and entrepreneurs with strategic show it website design templates and business coaching so that they can stand out, sell more, and stress way less about the tech and design in their business. If this sounds like information that you are interested in, then make sure to hit the subscribe button and check out the links in the show notes below to learn more about how I can best help you with your business website design and tech. So what are website pages and meta descriptions? Website page titles and meta descriptions are HTML tags that appear in the head section of a web pages source code. <laughs> so what the heck does that mean? Simply put, these things provide information about the content of your website page to search engines and website visitors. The page title is the main heading that appears at the top of your browser tab when you visit a website, and it tells both search engines and visitors what that page is about. So let me share my screen and explain this in, in an even simpler way. When you type in keywords like how to start a vegetable garden into a search engine like Google, you're going to be given a list of results like this. And you will see a bolded title right at the top here. This is your page title. And the smaller text below this, this is your meta description. The meta description is a brief summary of the page's content that appears below the page title in this uh, search engine results. So this really gives searchers a preview of what they can expect to find on the page. And you can see that it's using some keywords. So in the page title, we have for vegetable gardening for beginners. So if they have that keyword in there, it's gonna bring this up. Um, grow at home. So these are some keywords that are in the page title and the meta description. Now, why are website page titles and meta descriptions important? Page titles and meta descriptions are, are really essential for your website's SEO because they help search engines understand what your web pages are about. Search engines use this information to determine whether a page is relevant to a search query when someone types something in and to display the most relevant pages on the search engine results page. So well-written titles and descriptions can also entice users to click through to your website, which increases your click-through rate and therefore generates more traffic to your site. So these are some of the reasons why there's, it's so important for your website's SEO. Page titles and meta descriptions show up in browsers, in search engine results, and on social networks. For example, have you ever noticed when you share a link on something like Facebook, a title description and an image is generated? I'm gonna talk about more about images in another video, but if you ever share one and something generic or unrelated or a weird image is generated, then you know that your information isn't set up correctly on your website. So for example, if you don't manually add a page title to your site, it may show up in like a feed with a generic word that says homepage or some dummy text if you're using a template. So you wanna make sure that you are adding in your own page titles and meta descriptions to each page on your website before launching it. Hit the like button if this makes sense. If you purchase one of my show at website templates, I walk you step-by-step step through the process of how and exactly where to add in your page title and meta descriptions on each page. And I do this via my website without stress course that comes with every single template. Now let's discuss some key details. To write effective website page titles and meta descriptions, you should follow a few best practices. So number one, you wanna keep these concise and descriptive. Both titles and descriptions should be brief but informative. So I recommend page titles to be about 50 to 75 characters long 
and the description to be under 155 characters if possible so that nothing gets cut off. Number two, you want to include relevant keywords. Use relevant keywords that accurately reflect the content of your page. This really helps search engines understand the page topic and it improves its chances of ranking for the keywords. Number three, you want to avoid duplication. So a common mistake is that people put the same thing on every single page, but you want every page to have a unique title and meta description. Avoid duplicating titles and descriptions across different pages, as this can really confuse search engines and lead to lower rankings. And number four, you want to use persuasive language. That meta description is your opportunity to entice searchers to click through to your website. So using that enticing language and a call to action encourages clicks. And there you go. Website page titles and meta descriptions are critical for your website's SEO and can help increase traffic to your website. By following the best practices that I've discussed in this video, you can write effective titles and descriptions that accurately reflect the content of your pages that get found in search engine results and entice searchers to click through to your site. Ready to create your own website that is optimized for SEO? Make sure to check out the links in the show notes for some really great freebies and info on how I can help you stand out, sell more, and stress way less about the tech and design in your business.